So as you can see over my shoulder, um, it's snowing. It is Sunday morning, and technically we should be on an airplane right now uh, heading to our orientation, but uh, being that it's snowing here and being that they got a pretty big snow out in Chicago where my connecting flight was uh, taken off from, the airline canceled the flight. So uh, travel plans have changed. I don't know exactly when I'm going to head out, but we're supposed to get a 48 hour uh, long snow event here until all is said and done we might end up with 20 inches of snow so uh, probably won't be going anywhere this week maybe not till the weekend so uh, once again always something happens and like I said I was supposed to be on a plane right now and uh, here we are in the backyard so it's definitely too cold to stand out there and talk to you but um, I guess what we'll do is we will document this whole snowstorm as best we can and uh, show you its progression from now until it's over. Like I said, it's going to be a 36 to 48 hour long snow event. It probably won't stop snowing until either Monday night or Tuesday morning. And like I said, when all is said and done, 15 to 25 inches, probably somewhere around 20. It all depends on who gets the heavy bands once the coastal uh takes over and starts throwing moisture back into eastern Pennsylvania here. Those are the ones that give us the big two-foot snowstorm. So we'll see if we get the most or if somebody else does, but we'll try and document it for you as best we can. So we'll talk to you later on tonight, uh, tomorrow, most of the day, and Tuesday, and show you some of the aftermath and the cleanup, and then we'll see what happens as far as... Uh, traveling next weekend instead of this weekend but all right so as you can see it's still snowing out it is 10 p.m. on Sunday night um, had moderate snowfall and probably about three or four inches out there on the ground I didn't measure it last time I measured was 630 and we had almost two inches so we probably doubled that we're up to uh, about four inches and there's a lot more to come we're supposed to get snow all day tomorrow uh, all tomorrow night which is Monday and in the Tuesday morning maybe 9 a.m. to noon time before this thing pulls out because it's a low that came in across the Midwest and um, is bombing off the east coast and turning into a coastal storm and those usually give us a pretty good dumping so we could get another 10 to 20 inches before this is all said and done uh, tomorrow night Tuesday morning so and it's only uh, for most of the day it snowed out in Chicago which was where we were gonna get our connecting flight so it only stopped snowing there probably about seven eight o'clock tonight <laughs> So that was the main reason why the flight canceled because conditions were so bad out in Chicago, but they were deteriorating here as well. So um, we're kind of stuck now until maybe next weekend before we can get up there because, like I said, it's going to snow till probably Tuesday morning. Tuesday, Wednesday are going to be dig out days. If we get two feet of snow or possibly more, it's going to take a while for life to get back to normal. So. At this point, I wouldn't want to schedule another flight out until next weekend. Plus, uh, again, that way the wife can take me up to the airport. So, um, anyway, that's how our Sunday went. Um, I'm going to try and do each day and show you the progression of this storm from start to finish. Since we're stuck here at home instead of where we were supposed to be, we should have been in our motel room tonight and get ready for orientation tomorrow morning. But here we are stuck at the house, so another setback in this... Uh, year of setbacks that I've had since March of last year. It's been one thing after another and this just kind of adds insult to injury but what are you gonna do about it? Mother Nature sends it and there's nothing uh, we can do about it but deal with it I guess so. Alright, uh, I'm gonna try and work on this one and, uh, and do more video work tomorrow which is Monday February 1st and then more Tuesday February 2nd. That'll probably be a lot of showing you the cleanup of the snowfall so all right, we will talk to you later.